Hello to anybody and everybody watching this video. My name is Carmen and today we are going to be ranking every single hourly song in Animal Crossing. I'm pretty excited for this. I love the hourly music. It is some of the best music I've seen in a little game and it's very fun to hear something new every single hour. And since I play the game so much and maybe you play the game so much, it really never crossed my mind, uh, you know, which ones do I like the most and which ones do I like the least? So today you and I are going to sit down and we are going to decipher which ones deserve S through F on this tier list here, we're gonna see which ones are the best and the worst. So let's get right to it. So we are gonna start off strong with 7 a.m. and oh boy, I like this one a lot. It's very spring in your step-ish. It's very, okay, we're ready to start the day, let's get going. It's 7 a.m., here we go. It's very energetic, it's fun. I like 7 a lot. 7 a.m. is going to get an A tier. For me, personally, again, this is on personal choice. It's not based on anything statistical. It's just how it makes me feel and how I feel whenever I listen to them. Do I hate them? Do I like them? I like 7 a.m. So 7 a.m. is going to go in an A tier. So now we have 8 a.m. and we are going to go all the way through 7 a.m. all the way back around to 6 a.m. where we're gonna leave it off. And with 8 a.m., I'm not too struck on it as I am with 7. 8 a.m. feels very slow paced. It almost feels more like an afternoon song, more like 4 or 5. Not to mention it's very repetitive. It definitely loses some points in that aspect because of how many times it just repeats itself. That guitar, that strumming, not very fun for me. I'm going to put it at a D tier. Again with 9am, we kind of feel pretty slow, you know, it's the start of the day, we're supposed to get going, we're supposed to, like, come on, we need that boost. And this also feels like, you know, an afternoon song where you're kind of just getting ready to wind down. It is very cute, I really like the melody in this one, and I like how all the songs kind of have that um, similar melody as well, really sticking to the Animal Crossing roots. But for 9am, I like it a little more than 8, if I'm being honest, and I'm going to put it at C kind of in the middle there. It's it's not my favorite, but it's not my least favorite. It's just, it's missing something. And I don't know what it is. So next we have 10 a.m. and I like 10. It's, it's pretty springy, it's energetic, and it's fun. It's nice to listen to, it's, it's not very repetitive. So with that, I'm going to give 10 a.m. A C. I'm gonna give 10 a C. It's also not my favorite. It's not my least favorite. So we're gonna give him a C. Should we bump that up to a B? We'll decide later. Next we have 11 a.m. And with this one, again, it's just not hitting. 11 a.m. is very soothing though. It's very nice. It's it's a good way to just kind of sit back and relax. But for 11 a.m., when your day's kind of just getting started, no. Now your vibe might be a whole lot different. You might like soother music to start your day as you get more into the energetic side. For me, I like more so energetic music at the beginning, just to kind of really get you into the swing of things, into the flow of the day. And 11 a.m. is not that. I don't hate it, so that is why it's going to sit at a C. And if that goes at a C, I'm going to bump 10 a.m. up to a B, because I like 10 better than 11. So we're gonna switch a Rooney that. So journey. We're gonna put 11 a.m. at a, what did I say? C. I find that 12 p.m. is a perfect balance of soothing and fun. You have that nice cute melody in there. You also have your uh, guitar strumming. I'm going to give 12 p.m. a B tier. It is very nice. I like it a lot. Not so much so to give it an A or an S, but a B for sure. Comfortably a B. It reminds me of sunny weather. It reminds me of picking my flowers when it's all windy out and that feeling of just starting Animal Crossing back in the day. When that 12 p.m. music rolled around, I just felt very fresh and motivated to do more things to my island. So again, for that feeling, I'm gonna put it at a B. One p.m. I'm not very fond of one p.m. I was thinking of being nice and giving it an 
E tier, but when I'm just listening to it again, and how slow and boring and repetitive it is, I think I'm going to give 1pm an F. Sorry, 1pm, but you didn't impress me. Yeah, F tier. Maybe I'll be nice and change it later. Editing me might change things around. Again, 2PM is a nice rounded song. It's very soothing, but it's it has that funky aspect. But it sounds a little too goofy. It's almost annoying for me. But not as annoying as 1, so I'm going to give it an E. Sorry if you like 2PM, it doesn't strike me very well. I feel like 2PM tries to put you to sleep, but then with that annoying melody, it's like, haha, <laughs> can you sleep? No, because you're being annoyed by this melody. So it's a very confusing song. It's wanting to be soothing, and then all of a sudden that starts. Make up your mind. I don't like 2PM. 2PM is going at an E again. I have mixed feelings about. I think I've said that for every single song I've put on this list. It's true. Some of them just don't hit the same as others. I think 3 p.m. is nice. It's not an F or an E. I'm gonna put it at a D because I like that it is soothing. It's, it's kind of getting to that time of day where it's okay for the music to kind of die down a little bit because it's, it's mid-afternoon. It's time to start sitting back from all that hassle of doing all your island chores, talking to all your villagers and stuff like that. So I think that is acceptable in this circumstance for 3 p.m. to kind of be a little bit slower and there's nothing wrong with that. I love the slower songs. So yeah, I'm going to give 3 p.m. a D tier. It's not very impressive to me. I wouldn't jump to listen to it per se. So it's gonna sit comfortably at a D tier. 4pm. I really like 4pm. 4pm kind of gives me a sense of nostalgia in a way. I just remember two years ago, I've been graduated for about a year, but I remember like two years ago, three years ago, I would go and I would be getting home from school, a long day, a long, hard, tiring day, and I would just grab my switch and I would play and guess what time it would be? It would be around 4pm and that song is very nice because it's bubbly, it's cute, and it's very soothing too, so it just kind of gets me in that mindset of, okay, I'm home now. I can start to relax and, and play a game that I love. So 4 p.m. big W for that. I'm gonna put 4 p.m. at a B tier. Not the absolute best, but by far not the worst. I like 4 p.m. 5pm. I really like 5pm. It's very smooth sounding. It kind of hits each time and you're just... how do I describe it? I find 5pm one of those songs that I maybe hum back to myself or have it stuck in my head for a good reason. I mean, is it really good to have a song stuck in your head at all? That's debatable. Anyways, I think 5pm song is perfect for the time of day it is. It's not too slow and it's not too fast and it has that cool kind of catchiness to it, which I really adore. It's about this time of the game when the sun starts to set and you're maybe getting ready to do some evening things, evening chores, whatever it may be. And I think this is a last kind of boost before everything starts to kind of take it down a notch, if you get what I mean. So I'm going to put 5pm also at an A tier. 6pm see what I mean by everything kind of takes it down a notch. 6pm is a perfect example of that. I love 6pm. I'm going to give it a B tier. I love that guitar that you hear and I think it's a, a harmonica. I love those two mixed together and I love the slow pace that it takes it at and it's very good for the time of day. I like 6pm a lot so again that is going to go at a B tier. Not good enough for A and S but it's a very good spot for B. 7pm so I find to be a little bit boring and a little bit repetitive. The last thing I want to feel when I play this game is bored because as we all know sometimes we have that phase where we're not feeling as motivated as we may like to. We're trying to do things and complete things on our island and we're just here for a good time and get our chores done in the game and then 7pm rolls around. If I was feeling a little burnt out and 7pm music rolled around I'd probably shut the game off. It's not terrible, it's just a little bit boring. It doesn't give me that drive as something as an A or an S tier would give me. So I'm going to give it a C tier. 7 p.m. is going to go at a C tier. If it was a little more energetic, maybe I would like it, but it's just lacking something. Again, I know it's 
evening time, it's getting towards night, but I think it's a little too slow for nighttime or at least this time of night, 7 p.m. I think it more suits the 1 a.m. to maybe 4 a.m. bracket, but that's just me. When I thought about it earlier, I gave When I thought about it earlier, I gave 8 p.m. a, I think it was a D, but now that I hear it back once again, it's boring. And it, this one is insanely repetitive to my ears. I'm gonna give 8 p.m. an E, not an F, it's not, it's not that bad. It, it kind of picks up in the middle of the song, but you know those people who are like, oh yeah, yeah man, you should watch this show, it, it gets good after um, episode. 360. That's kind of like what this song reminds me of. It, it takes a while to get into the good bit, which I don't like at all. I want something nice right away. I don't want a huge, boring, slow build up like 8 p.m. So I'm going to give 8 p.m. an E. Same with 9, but I'm going to put it a tier above just because I think it's a little bit better than 8 p.m. 9 p.m. is going to get a D tier because it's more calming. It's not necessarily it's it's slow and then it kind of gets better gradually along the way. It's kind of like that throughout the whole thing, just soothing, and I know that's what it's meant to be because, you know, it's 9 p.m. It's nighttime. It's time to wind down and get relaxed, and I've said that for every single song, but I think that 9 a.m. is better in that sense just because it is what it is. It's not boring leading up to something new. It's kind of the same throughout it all, and not to mention I like what it sounds like as well, so I'm going to give 9 p.m. a D tier. I think I have the exact same feelings for 10 p.m. as I do 9 p.m. I'm going to put that at a D as well. I think I had it lower when I was thinking about it, but when I kind of compared them right now, they sound very similar, but I would in no way say that 9 p.m. is better than 10, so I'm going to match them together. And I like it for the time. I, I like 10 p.m. a lot for the time that it is. It's 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 soothing, but it, it is fun in a way too. I like that high tone that it goes for right from the very beginning. It kind of gives you a bit of a difference from what you were previously hearing for the past two hours, which was 8 and 9 p.m. So yeah, I'm going to give 10 p.m. a D tier as well. Should I move 9 p.m. down a tier? Am I gonna regret this? Is editing me gonna regret this? Forgive me. I'm gonna put it 9 p.m. in between is a D point E. It's in between. It's it's neither there there. Sorry, editing me, if that's a hassle. Whoops. If I had trouble sleeping and I was really needing some help, I would not go to a doctor for maybe a medical prescription. I would go to 11 p.m. Animal Crossing New Horizons music. This is going to be F tier on this list. I do not like 11 p.m. at all. It is so boring. It is so slow. It is, there's nothing to it. There's no, there's no anything. Enough said. 11 is an F. I don't like 11. Moving on to midnight, 12 a.m. I like it. I like that high pitch tone it's going for. Again, that nice strumming of the guitar in the background. It's very soothing. It's very nice. It's around this time where it's like, do you keep going or do you sacrifice your precious sleep schedule to get a little bit more of that sweet gameplay? That's what midnight feels like. It feels like it's trying to convince you to go to bed, but in a good way. I'm going to put 12 a.m. at... C or a D. I think I'm gonna do a D because it's it's not deserving of the lower ranks. Well, I guess D is kind of, but it's not deserving of the higher ones either. It's kind of just right a bit below the middle for me personally, but it's nice. It's soothing. I, I don't hate when 12 a.m. rolls around at all. I really like 1am. 1am is going to get a B tier. It is very fun for the time of day it is, and it's, mm, you know what, A tier. I think I'm gonna put it in A tier. It's deserving of that because not only does it sound superb, but it's fun, and I like that flow of it all. 
It sounds a lot different from the rest, if I'm being honest. A lot of them kind of have that same guitar strum in the background and, you know, your basic melody. But this one, I think, tries to go for something a little different, a little bit of a different feel. And that's why I like it so much, so that is why I'm going to sit it at an A tier. am is kind of what you would expect. Very cozy, very relaxing, very soothing, very 2 a.m. It's very nice. I would definitely not call it a skip. Like, you have the choice. You say, you know, if it came on on a playlist, actually, I'd skip it. I'm gonna go and give 2 a.m. a D tier. I think that's where it belongs. It's it's cute and it's fun and it's soothing for a 2 p.m. song or 2 a.m. song, but I'm not thoroughly impressed by it. It's not like a song that awakens something in me. So I'm going to put 2 a.m. at D. This has got to be the goofiest song I've ever heard, and not just in Animal Crossing. Why does it just remind me of a, a waddling duck? You know that duck in the lemonade stand song? This is what it reminds me of. It's funny, I like that fact, but to listen to it for an hour straight? Not to mention at 3am when you're probably feeling a little bit uh, F tier. You're gonna join right with 11pm. Sorry, 3am, but you're too goofy. You're, you're just simply too silly. What an odd song. I am very boring. I'm gonna say this for the 30th time in a row. I get it for the time of day it is, but it's just not for me. It's it's too slow almost. It's really telling me to go to bed here. Please, please get your sleep. Animal Crossing begs of you. It's 4 a.m. here, we're gonna hit you with this slow song. You know, that's not what I want. If I choose to stay up till 4 a.m., it's because I want to play and be entertained. And 4 a.m. is not entertaining. Mind you, not as bad as that goofy song of 3 a.m. So that is why it's going to get an E tier, not an F. 5 a.m., finally. We are getting our first and only, spoiler alert, S tier. 5 a.m. is beautiful. It really showcases the piano. Piano is my favorite instrument. I don't know if you can see it. It's slow in the best way possible. I love the piano, and this is about the time of the game when the sun starts to rise. It matches so well for the feeling of how you're playing at that time, whether it's you staying up till 5 a.m. or maybe just getting started with your day at 5 a.m. Regardless, it's, it's that perfect way to either sign on or sign off, which I love. It's very well-rounded. It's not boring, it's just nice. And I love how the piano incorporates that, you know, main theme of the song. Overall, S tier, for sure. 5 a.m. first and only S tier. a.m. reminds me of after you've watched the sunrise and it's officially time to begin. To me, 6 a.m. is where morning begins. I know it's not technically correct, but it's just where a day starts for me personally. Not like, I'm not saying I, I get up at 6 a.m. every day. Oof. You know, that's just my idea of the difference between morning and night is 6 a.m. And I think this is a very good way to start a day. It, it really has that, okay, let's start going feel. That is why I'm going to give it a C. It's not the best, it's not the worst, it's just a perfect middle grounds of energetic sounding in a way and soothing just so it's not like bam right in your face, it's morning, let's go. It's more like a, okay, let's ease into this a little bit, you know? It's still early, I'm still trying to get adjusted to daylight. So that is why 6am is going to get a C on this list. 'm going to give it a D and the only reason I'm putting it so low is because if you didn't know it plays for the first week of when you start playing the game and I'm putting it so low because it plays for the first week of playing the game hours and hours days and days straight of just that let me tell you what I was so glad to be able to get the hourly music after I reached that time it's nice it's soothing but not 
soothing enough to listen to it on repeat for seven days. And with that all said and done, here is my personal list of where I think the Animal Crossing New Horizons hourly music songs should be placed. I thought about it a bit ahead of time, and I like to see that I made a couple changes. Maybe I'll make some changes when I'm editing, I have no idea, sorry, once again. But yeah, it was very fun to do this, I'm kind of finding things to do in regards to Animal Crossing as I'm having this little downtime of between when I'm about to flatten my island, which I'm going to live stream. So if you want to check out that Twitch where I'm going to be live streaming every so often, I will leave that in the link in the description. But for now, thank you to anybody and everybody who watched this video. I really, really appreciate it. And I would also appreciate if you subscribed and liked this video. Doing these two things helps us as a channel to grow and it also helps me push my content out to people who enjoy this type of content and in turn inspires me to make more of it. So it's kind of a win-win for everybody. Okay, thank you very much for watching me arrange this tier list based on my personal likes and dislikes and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.